Hey, how's it going everybody? Welcome back to Souling the Ark. I'm Flicker Foo, and today we are joined at the exact same very spot I left yesterday. No, actually, that's not really by plan. But um, I actually just came out here because today, um, today I think we're gonna head into our first cave with the new found pack that we've got. Um, I think I want to go spelunking today. I think today's gonna be the first of several episodes. I'm not sure if I'm gonna do them in a quick succession and get them all done that way, or if I'm going to gradually, slowly, eventually work my way up from here. Yes. So, <laughs> today, um, we are joined by a few dinos, and I named them, all right? So, yeah, we already have stupid raptors. All right, and then um, we have Senor Chomps. I figured it was good. All right, and then we have Smeghead, and then we have Deo Delicious because he's bacon. So, yeah. All right, and then when we're done um, using him for our spelunking adventures, we can make a pizza out of him. Why not? All right. So, <laughs> yeah, um, we're going to. I'm going to be leveling these guys up a little bit. I'm going to do that a little bit off camera. Um, I'm going to take them around, make sure they're cave worthy. Right now, they only have like one or two levels each. But um, I'm going to take them out. I'm going to spend probably about 20 or 30 minutes leveling each one. And then um, we're going to take them into the cave. But in order to go into the cave, we need to first clear out our inventory. Uh, stone goes... Stone goes... Uh, wow, I'm out of stone? Oh, Tommy, we got a, we got a date with some rocks. All right? Um, let's see. Um, I don't need any more narcotics, so we'll leave that there. And then uh, we spoiled meat. No, and I don't want to bring my trank darts. I don't need them. All right, coming through here, the canyon, through the um, to the first cave that we're going to do. And I have to say, the new AI with the pack mentality, so much better. Well, the new follow um, oh, mechanic, it is so good. I mean, look at these guys. None of them are getting lost in nothing. I can go through a little bit. I mean, they'll get lost a little bit. I mean, like... Between this, behind this rock. I mean, yeah. No, they're there! Hey! They made it! All right. So, yeah. Um, wow. Uh, yeah, it's... it's it, The new uh, follow mechanic, it's pretty good. So far, it's been a very painless trip. Um, just coming down. I think the only time that we really had any problems was when we had a, uh, a group of compies come at us and we aggroed a group of turtles. It was really nothing. All right, all right, come on, dude. Oh, is that where his corpse went? Okay, all right. All right, did we already pass the, uh... We did. Oh, we did, we passed the cave. Come on, let's get back here. All right, come on. Can you guys turn around? Is that a thing? Is reverse an option? It is, all right! All right, so, uh, yeah, let's get over here. Um, the cave should be right about... Here, hey, nailed it. All right, so now I'm gonna get them inside and we're going to park right up inside. Can you guys, you guys are just gonna follow me right in the cave? Oh my gosh, that's so awesome. All right, so which one should we do first? All right, let's put them all right like this, get them all ready. And I can already tell you that the hardest one is gonna be Stupid Raptor. Um, that's my prediction. The hardest one's gonna be Stupid Raptor. The easiest one's probably gonna be the Deodon. The funnest one is probably gonna be either uh, Senor Chomps or Smeghead. Something like that. All right, so... Uh, God, I'm stuck on tails, guys. All right, I um, figured those tiny tails wouldn't be so, uh, you know... Prehensile, I guess, would be the thing, you know? Obstructive. All right, so, um, yeah, I think I'm going to take in Smeghead first. Because, you know, I mean... Ah, come on. Yeah. Once I can get on him. Come on, can I climb up here? All right. So let's take Smeghead in first. Oh, and I didn't grab any of the stuff to make a torch. Ah, all right, all right, all right. It'll be fine. It'll be fine, I swear. All right. So let's get in here. See how much damage we can cause. All right, and this first cave, um, it's this one's pretty straightforward. You can uh, when you come down to uh, not that one, down here. 
Oh, ominous music as we go through. I realized it was just the change of uh, time. It's daylight. It's noon, so yeah. All right, now when you come down here, you can go left. Whoa, 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 whoa. You can go left or you can go right, or you can get ambushed by that little turd. I really want to tame me one of those, but not right now. <laughs> whoa, all right. That was a little jump scare. All right, so um, yeah, you can go left or you can go right. And then um, what spawns in these caves, it, it's kind of random, it's kind of not. Once in a while, you know, you'll have certain spots where um, oh, certain things spawn, like these uh, spiders will always spawn over here. And then every once in a while, you'll get some other stuff. Um, wow, all right. Get unwebbed and unpoisoned. All right, but now we should already have a whole bunch. Yeah, we've already got. We're going to keep this on hand. And then all this chitin and keratin, uh, that stuff right there. Um, if you really wanted to save a bunch, you could set a, uh, um area out front. So, um, you know, like a little uh, two by two shack that has just a whole bunch of uh, storage boxes in it. And you could just unload a ton of uh, um, chitin and keratin in there. We're not going to do that, though. We're going to keep one stack of meat, dump the rest. And then continue on about our merry little way all right now over here every once in a while you'll get um come on all right yeah right down there you'll get arthropleura um and once in a while they'll actually be like right up here on this ledge so you want to keep an eye out on that and but we're not going to go down that. that that right there is actually this is the shortcut to get to the artifact is going down there um i'm not going to do it i'm in combat why am i in combat Probably the Arthropleura. All right, um, we're not gonna go take the shortcut. We're gonna go the long way. Do you have rabies, dude? No, you're tranquilized. Oh, you have torpidity. It's going up slowly. Good thing you have seven thousand torpor. Good job, Smackhead. Good job on having the seven thousand torpor. Bet you can really hold your liquor, huh? All right. So um, yeah, we're going to uh, work our way through here. Killing a bunch of spiders, and he does 114 per hit, which is pretty good inside a cave. Um, it could be better. Um, around uh, 200 is the ideal, maybe 250 for when you get into uh, tougher ones like the swamp cave, stuff like that, because things in there are so much uh, more dangerous. And then our tour force is really going to go up here. There's a bunch of titan boas. And titan boas, you want to keep an eye out for eggs. Whenever you see titan boas, Instantly look around and see if you see any little white things on the ground. Those are Titan Bow eggs. Yeah. Scorpions up front. How's your torpor? 203 and raising, 205. All right, you should be fine. All right, let's 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 take on some scorpions. And there's our first one, these guys. These guys right here, you want to charge. Just get right up in their grill. Because they will eat your armor, and it hurts. It hurts bad. Yep, there we go. There's the first little bit of armor, and that's why we brought the fiber with us. I'm going to have to force feed spank head a little bit after this. You want to make sure that inside these caves, that your... Um, armor is always topped off. All right. Now, there were some uh, Titan Bows around here. So, while I'm waiting on uh, his Torpor to wear off, we're going to... Uh, I'm going to repair my armor. And here, let me show you. So, yeah, see, now, now our armor's over in here. And we can just repair this on the fly. Just repair. 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 What didn't get damaged? Oh, hey, my gloves. Right. All right, and then we can just put it right back on. All right, what's what's attacking me? I heard it. Something's attacking me. Show yourself, dude. No? All right. Don't want to show yourself. That's fine. All right. I got my glass. You know, I'll just repair that anyway. There we go. And see, it's really easy. Um, 
Take that, drop that. You know what? Give you a little bit more health and we'll just feed you. All right, so yeah, I'm gonna be uh, force feeding him a bit and I'll see you guys in a bit. All right, heading back in and there seems to be a snake in the wall. I can hear it slithering. And some spiders over there hiding. All right, so we got that dead. Oh man, I just got rid of my poison. Now I have it again. All right, now right here, this, um, this are, oh. really? You can hit me through the wall. You're in the wall and you can hit me, but I can't hit you. Can I hit you? There you are. I see you. Yeah, you can't hide from me, little jerk. All right. So yeah, um, what was I saying? <laughs> Oh yeah, coming through here, and you just want to make sure that you keep an eye out for Megalosaurs. Um, because they are here, and they are mean. Well, they have a chance of being here, and being mean. I'm just going to kill these guys. That guy hit me. Oh yeah, you jerk. Damage my armor. These guys just demolish your armor. All right, spider. Yeah. All right, come on, Mr. Spider. And there's a, uh, I've already, this is my second dung beetle I've seen in here. It's pretty cool. Um, there might actually have been a third one that I missed, but yeah, uh, third one right there. Uh, dung beetles, they're all over inside of here. Oh. Metal. Oh. <laughs> All right, and here's a spider, and I want to get this guy. Um, I don't think I can go through this little area right here. Um, we're going to have to go around, but I wanted to come around this side and get that spider first. The aggro, the dung beetle? No. All right. Dung beetles can actually be kind of vicious. They'll, they'll follow you, and they'll hunt you down. And, I mean, you don't really want to kill them, but they just won't stop attacking. So you have to kill them. Let's go through here. Oh, here's some more spiders. Come on, spiders. Come on. You guys respawn fast. Come on. Can you get through there? You're not gonna get through there. All right, all right, fine. I'll just come over here. I'm gonna be over here stealing your... Dude, you smacked me from that far away? That's a good shot. All right, so I'm gonna be over here stealing your uh, artifact that you're supposed to be in here guarding. You know why you guys just sit there and look, watch? Yeah? All right, good luck with that. All right, so uh, yeah, we've got an artifact. Artifact of the Hunter. On Smeghead, pretty easy. Um, the only thing is, yeah, they have a little bit lower health. Um, they, uh, hit really hard, uh, Sabertooths. And... It's, uh, you just have to watch their health a little bit. Make sure that you don't get in stuff, uh, too tricky. Um, like that one fight right over here. That one right there, it was pretty, it was pretty rough. But, uh, yeah, so, uh, Sabertooth, I will rate them later. After we're done doing these, because I have to get out here, I have to let the cave reset. And, uh, yeah, it's gonna take me a little bit, so it's time for me to AFK and go make me a cup of coffee. Right? Got an artifact, and I'll see you guys in a bit. Okay, this new collision detection, really cool. Alright. <clears throat> it's really nice. Um, I'm just out here making a shack with uh, some of the uh, primitive stone tools that I found on Smeghead from going through the first cave. And yeah, so now we can just come out here, pop in uh, artifacts as we go through and do all this. Yeah, I'm probably going to end up having one uh, of these outside each one. Yeah, it, it's kind of thing. Um, so now I just need to get a door. Uh, just a door. All right, see you guys in a bit. And a bed. All right, let's, uh, let's see. Let's do... Ow. Okay, this, this is nice. I hear you, Smeghead. All right, just chill out. All right, so which cave is this? This is Hunter. All right, so we're going to rename this uh, Bed. We're just going to call it Hunter. There we go.
It's just the bed outside the cave of the hunter. With all my artifacts. And hopefully the stuff should be respawned by now. It's taken me a little while. Not too long, but yeah. All right. Let's try the next one. Um, Yeah, you know, I'm going to wait just a little bit longer. I want to make sure it's good and uh, respawn. So I will see you guys in a bit. All right, Senor Chomp's turn. And this guy right here, um... Well, it's a little early. I just came down through the first spider ledge. Here, are these guys back up? Oh, there's spiders down there this time. Okay. All right, all right. Hey, guys. How are you doing down there? Yeah, good luck with that. You have to keep an eye out for the uh, ceiling guys while we're doing this. And normally I would be uh, also in the other caves. Um, I think I am going to concentrate a little bit on how to get the loot drops. But on this one right here, the loot drops, um, they're not as important. Because uh, if you want to like ramshackle uh, stone tools, this is your cave. But other than that, I mean, it's, it's really not that, that bad. Okay, there's some... Uh, Arthur Pleur down there. I want to charge those guys. Alright, let's... Bam! Oh, man. Ah, oh, jeez. Oh, there... You were hiding, you little jerk. Alright, alright, alright. Ah, oh, you broke my gloves, too? Little creep. This one right here was a lot easier this time than it was last time. Hopefully everything respawned. I want to get a nice valid test of which one is better. All right. Um, let's see. Uh, really? Oh, you're going to come at me? Right when I'm repairing my stuff? Yeah, and then that's why you die. All right. Um, I hear you. Where are you? Where are you? You in the walls? You are. Somewhere in these walls is a Titan Boa that wants to eat me. <laughs> Not creepy at all, really. Oh, no, not transfer. Give me that back. And it's important that you, uh, and you do actually repair your armor while you're in here because even on the back of a uh, dino, um, those uh, Arthoplura, they do damage to you. So you want to make sure that you keep uh, your armor repaired because uh, you're, the, the main thing is, I mean, they don't do a lot of damage to you, but a lot of them built up can build up the damage, if that makes sense. Um, and then also... It will, it'll destroy your, uh, your food supply that you brought with you. Oh, what? All right, so Smeghead actually does a little bit more damage than this guy, but leveled up, Direwolves do more damage than Sabertooth. It's, it's kind of, that's kind of the rule of thumb. That, uh, oh, there's a, there. Hey, dude. Thought you were getting away, huh? Yeah, no way. Nobody escapes Senor Chomps. All right. But yeah, um... Um, Direwolves have a higher base damage than Sabertooths. So... I hear a spider around here. Where are you? Where are you? Oh, there you are! So, leveled up. Um, Direwolves, they get more and more impressive the higher level they get in comparison to Sabertooth. So, Mr. Junk Beetle, you're not going to aggro, are you? All right. All right, let's come over to this side. And then also, I think on the Deodon, I will go over and we'll uh, explore the other side. Because it's not uh, going to be... Over there, it's not going to really be that necessary because the artifact's over here. But... And then that's what we're kind of testing is which dino is the easiest one to get in here and get the artifacts with. So, and then with this right here, you can just come right inside here. 
Grab the artifact. Double check, make sure we can actually hop off without getting... Oh. It just immediately respawns? That's cool. Here's something. But I don't see something. All right. So, yeah. Um, let's head back out. Let's get it reset. And then next time, it's uh, Stupid Raptor's turn. Stupid Raptor... Um, I don't think he's going to have that much problems in this cave. He's just not going to be the ideal mount. Yeah. Is that you making all that noise, Mr. Dung Beetle? All right. All right. All right, so yeah, I will see you guys in a bit. All right, stupid raptor's turn. We've got a nest of boas. Come on. Ah. And he doesn't hit very hard at all, but he hits super fast. That's, that's his thing. But he can't take a beating. So, yeah. Uh, or her thing. I forgot. Stupid Raptor's girl. Okay. Right. Right. Take him forever to kill these guys. Oh, hey. We have a green drop now. I want to keep an eye out for those uh, ceiling lurker guys. These guys are not cool. Not, not cool. I mean, they're cool. But when I'm, you know, when I have one, but if I don't have one, not nearly as cool. And they're, when they're trying to eat my face, they're not nearly as cool. All right, so let's see what's in here. Yay, cloth boots. All right. Let's see. Get down here. Tail freaked me out, dude. Keep an eye. I want to make sure I don't walk into any traps with those uh, ceiling dudes. Because that would not be fun. Not on a stupid raptor. Got down here. Oh, no. All right. These guys suck on a raptor because you just don't deal enough damage to kill them quick. Can I push you off the edge? Don't push me off the edge. All right, now you're dead. Whoa, all right. Now my uh, armor took a little bit of a beating. Huh. These things not respawn all the way? That's just all that's in here. Here. Oh, spiders. Yeah, okay, they respawn. I'm, I'm using this spot right here to make sure that everything's respawned. I'm killing this right before I go get the artifact. So where I can ensure that um, that's the average, that is the um, cave respawn. So, can a stupid raptor fit through here? Stupid raptors, they can actually fit through uh, spots that some dinos can't because they're thin. Ooh. Your torpor's gone up quite a bit. Let's see. Uh, 300, you'll be fine. And she doesn't have nearly as much uh, torpor as the uh, as Smeghead or uh, Senor Chomps. So I want to keep a very close eye on that. Um, This is not nearly as easy as the other ones. Even though I haven't fought, I haven't encountered nearly as many uh, dinos on this one. On this respawn. So, I would have to say that out of all of them so far, uh, Stupid Raptor is, of course, not as good as... Oh. Hey, dude. I wasn't expecting you in here. Oh, that... You guys were spawned on the other side. You're tricky like that. Ooh, that made me jump a bit. Just a bit. All right. All right. Artifact. Hey, 
get out of here. Whew, all right. So now we get to come through with the Deodon. That should be fun, because I think we're gonna do a full cave clear with the Deodon. The Deodon has got a ton of hit points and can heal and yeah, it's the Deodon should be pretty easy. But we're gonna try it out. We're gonna see just how um, well we can fit through everything because the Deodon's also bigger than all the rest. So yeah. All right, but then again, if we can get a butt spot in here, then we should be able to get a Deodon in here, no problem. All right, so I'll see you guys in a bit. All right, coming down in here with Deodo Delicious, and wow, all right, so let's get down here. And this guy right here, he already feels beefier. Um, he's just tougher. I mean, he's got a lot more hit points. I've got him up to 8,000 hit points so far. That's really good. 373 damage. Uh, let's keep an eye out up here. I don't want anything jumping out of the woodwork at me or at the, out of the rock work at me like we did when we first got in here. And this time, we're actually going to go right. Oh, wow, okay. A couple of these first off. All right, and you're already hitting for 108. That's really good. Um, wow. All right, let's get you a whole bunch of meat because you're going to be needing a lot of meat in here. All right, come on, guys. Come on, just line up. Single file line, come on in. Get your beaten, and then make room for the next guy. Make, make sure when you die that your corpse gets pushed off to the side. So where, uh, yeah, I can freely hit the ones behind you, okay? Sweet. All right. Wait for that to wear off. And also, where, what's this torpor? 10,000 torpor. Yeah, we don't have to worry about torpor in here. Uh, yeah. Spiders over there, spiders over there. A whole ton of bad things. My armor's gonna die here. Oh, wow. I'm glad that I took the Deodon over here. Stupid Raptor, I don't think, would have been able to make it. Oh, yeah, we're already taking damage. Come on. Come on. No, no, no. All right, yeah, we got to run because ourselves is taking a beating. Wow. All right. Whoa, 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 yeah. Oh, let's get out of there. Oh, we need to heal ourselves up. Yeah, we wouldn't have been able to make that with uh, any... Well, we might have been able to make that with the direwolf. Because... Get a food. Because the direwolf has so much damage. And we might have been able to make that with Smeghead, but... I mean, how much damage have we taken so far? Well, we haven't taken nearly any damage. Most of the damage is just in our face. I mean, this right here, uh, wow. Yeah, I, we were down to a sliver there for a sec. All right, let's give you swarm melee damage. All right, re-equip my armor. Beats, chest. You see, normally this cave, it's, it's really not that tough, but when you have a encounter with a ton of Arthropleura, any cave is dangerous. Oh, hey, Mr. Uh, Boa. You followed me up here. Thanks, dude. Oh, I knew you wanted to be friends. Let's get some more meat. Get that thing going for a sec. All right, where'd that Arthropleura go? Where'd you go, dude? Oh. All right, let's see. Arthropleura around here somewhere. Where'd you go, dude? I've already gotten this XP buff on butts, bud. There's some boas.
I mean, this cave isn't the toughest thing, but every once in a while... Hey, Carbo saddle. All right. This cave isn't the toughest thing, but every once in a while, it'll throw you for a loop and just be like, Hey, remember me? I'm actually, uh, will kick your butt if you're not paying attention. Down here. Every once in a while, you'll meet something down. There we go. That's what I was looking for. Hey, Mr. Boa. None of these guys have dropped eggs yet, either. That sucks. Spider up here. Hey, Mr. Spider. Come on. More spiders behind there. And Boa. Boa's dead. Spider. Hey, Spider. Bye, Spider. Get this. Hey, sweet. We've got Ramshackle, Stone Pick, Blueprint. More boas. Spider. In the water. Oh, there's a loot drop down there, but I really don't care about that. Not with spiders in the water. Oh, this is new. Is that you, Rally? That one of those ceiling guys snoring up there going, hey, don't mind me. I'm just up here going to drop down on you. Oh, hey. Sweet. Spider over here, right? That is a spider. Yeah. Come on, dude. Come on, dude. Stop playing peekaboo. There you go. Now you're dead. All right, how many levels do we have? Just one. Okay, we'll get some more melee damage. Yeah. All right, come on, let's jump and get out of that. All right. Where are you, Mr. Spider? Are you the one in the water? I don't know. All right. All right, let's get over here. And see, this cave, it, it's pretty good. Um, I mean, it's great entry level one. You can actually, with enough people, you can actually come in here and just pike it to death. No, no, no. No. Come on. Get the dude dead. Ugh. Thank you. Yeah, that was so good I had to poop. All right, let's, uh, more melee damage on you. Get out of that. All right, now I got to fix my pants. All right, because I do still intend on fighting evil today, and I might need pants for that. All right. Beep. I'll, I'll repair that too. And see, this is the benefit of bringing a bunch of fiber into the uh, caves. It's where you have all of that readily available. You can just grab the, um, hide, or the, uh, yeah, the hide off, uh, your, you know, your dino, and just fix everything as necessary. Ceiling, guys. Sweet! Primitive stone pick! Nailed it! Let's get over here. Alright, let's get over and let's go grab that artifact, because I think that might be it. 
Oh no! I just repaired my armor! But I gotta do a full clear. That's got oh man, that hurt. I just repaired those pants too. Alright, so we're gonna get over, we're gonna get the artifact, and I'll see you guys in a bit. Alright, and we're here. Alright, so... That thing just immediately respawns. That's kind of cool. Alright, so yeah, um... Now that we've, uh, done the entire cave with four different dinos, what's the verdict? Well, the verdict, um... It depends on, uh, I mean, how much frustration level you want and how easily obtainable some of these dinos are. Um, if you're up in the north area, and or you're up close to the north area and you have access to dire wolves, that would be the one that I recommend going through here with. Because they just hit harder, they have more hit points, yeah, they do take a little bit more damage. You weren't here when I came through. All right, um, they take a little bit more damage than saber tooths, but I would, I would recommend... Um, a dire wolf base uh, out of a, a zero out of well a one through ten scale I would give a dire wolf probably about an 8.5 yeah they have a few things that could go wrong but not bad I would give a saber tooth about an eight um the deodon uh the deodon's good but he just attacks slower I mean he hits hard but he he attacks slower I mean the time in between attacks it's just not as good as, say, the Dire Wolf or the Sabretooth, or even the Raptor, for that matter. The Raptor attacks super fast. That's how they get most of their DPS, is the speed of their attacks. Um, but, uh, yeah, um, I would say Senor Chomps was the best. Uh, Smeghead right behind Senor Chomps. Um, but as those two level up, the disparity between the two will get uh, much bigger. As the Dire Wolf gets higher level... Um, he'll become much, much, much tougher than Spankhead. Um, the Raptor is, I would give the Raptor probably about a four or five. Um, there's so many, so many different things inside this cave, especially where you can just get set upon by a bunch. That one back there where I had to run with the Deodon, we would have died with the Raptor if we wouldn't have gotten out of there right away. We would, we would have died. Um... Senor Chomps probably would have just been able to face tank it and then kill the uh, Arthropleura before um, they ended up killing me. Smeghead would have been a little bit riskier, a little bit trickier, but I think he could have done it too. But then also with the Deodon, we had to run. So, yeah. Um, so if you were going to do this cave, I would recommend getting a Dire Wolf and just coming through here and then just kind of face rolling it. Um... If you don't have access to a dire wolf, then a saber tooth will do it. Just, just almost as well. Um, oh, and then also for uh, ratings on this uh, cave, I would give the Deodon probably about a seven on this. Um, it's not the fastest thing. Um, doesn't attack the best, but can take the best beating. But with a bunch of Arthropleura, it doesn't matter how much of a um, beating they can take. You need to be able to out DPS them. So you need to be able to take a hit while dealing a ton of DPS. So that's why the dire wolf and the saber tooth went out. Um, I'm sure in other caves it might be a little bit different, but for this one, for the cave of uh, the hunter, that's my recommendation. So yeah, all right. So uh, yeah, I'm gonna get these guys back to base. And here, hold on, let me get a good shot for these guys, because I mean they've earned it. They've earned it. I mean even stupid raptors earned his paycheck today or her paycheck. I mean because it's not too bad. All right. So hey. If you liked the video, click that like button. I really appreciate that. And until next time, this is Flinger Foo. And take it easy, everyone. Whew. All right, you guys actually did pretty good. I even you, stupid raptor. Yeah. Not as good as the others, but still pretty good, all right? Yeah. I mean, you're faster than the other ones, but yeah. All right. Take it easy, everyone.